Yeah, yeah, you touched briefly on that Saturday. It was the best thing to say it was a very disappointing performance, wasn't it? Yeah, it was, yeah. I don't think the lads were quite at the races. And, um, yeah, it's just well, a good day, really. I think all the boys are looking forward to this Saturday now and putting it right and getting the first three points on the board. When, when you come off the pitch after a game like that, is it your immediate reaction, we must do better next, in next time? Or? Yeah, I think definitely, really. Um, all the lads knew they weren't at it. And, you know, I think... Even though we didn't play well, I think we still could have got. You know, it was a bad decision for the for the pen, and we still could have got something for it. But it's one of them things. Yeah, I think all the lads are now looking forward to uh, to Saturday putting it right. No point in dwelling on it. So, how's training been this week? Yeah, it's been good to be fair. It's been sharp. The boys had a game um, Tuesday, was it? Mm -hmm. Against Exeter. So, the players that needed games there, like Bunty and. Uh, uh, Gilly and stuff, so that's good for them. And, uh, hopefully they'll they'll be back in the squad soon and stuff like that. It would be good to have some exp a little bit more experience back in the dressing room. Yeah, it would be. Yeah, I think still young and that, and obviously you know the injury situation. So it's brilliant when you see them like joining in the warm up and you know on their way back to uh, to sort of full time training. So yeah, it'd be nice when they're. A few more back. I guess a front has run out and he got a goal on Tuesday, so uh, and, and he also played a little bit last Saturday, so it'll be good to see him and to give a, yeah, a little bit of support. Yeah, definitely, yeah, I think we need, need all the players we can sort of get at the minute, you know, with all the injuries and stuff. Uh, the squad's a little bit, um, was young, but, you know, inexperienced at the minute, so, yeah, definitely any bit of... Um, all the players coming back is just brilliant. Really. What, what sort of game do you expect on Saturday? I mean, York have, have only scored one goal as well, I think. Have they? <laughs> well, yeah, we need, to, we need to up our game, I think that's that's for sure. So I think, I think you'll see um, a different side to last Saturday, definitely. And, and obviously, you, you, we want the fans behind you. They, they've stuck with you so far, haven't they? Yeah. And the home game makes yeah, it the fans are brilliant here. So I wouldn't expect anything less from them, to be honest. So. Yeah, all I can say is get behind the boys again and, you know, I think we'll do a lot better. <laughs> but they actually had a big influence on you coming back, I guess, didn't they? Yeah, yeah, the, they were brilliant with me last season and, you know, I was getting a lot of love from them and stuff. So, yeah, it was definitely, um, definitely helped, you know, when I was thinking of signing and stuff. So, yeah, if they could just carry on doing what they were doing last year and get behind the boys, that'd be, that'd be brilliant. How do, how do you think your, your return has gone so far? In terms of results, it hasn't gone well, but on a personal level? Um, yeah, I haven't had... Yeah, I haven't quite got going. Yeah, I don't think I don't think any of the boys have really, but... Um, yeah, I want to get the fitness going a little bit, you know. I feel like I'm getting more fitter every game and stuff, so... Yeah, I'm, Need a first win, I think. <laughs> Look, that would presumably lift confidence. Yeah, yeah I think that will settle everyone once we get that first win, and then I think everyone will be a lot calmer. And because uh, I think even like the opening day, I think boys were like a little bit on edge. So I think we just need that first win, and I think it will settle everyone and we'll be right after that. We hope that comes. In just a, a week or so's time, or just well, two weeks time, we got that matter of a Bristol derby. And, That'll be your first experience of one. Is that one to look forward to? Yeah, massively. I think obviously everyone knows. Everyone here knows the size of the game. I've never played them. I don't think I've, I've ever played in one as big as that. So um, it'll be interesting. It'll be, it'll be good. It'll be uh, lively down at um, Ashton Gate. I'd say so. Um, yeah, looking forward to it. But I think at the minute I'm just concentrating on Saturday and getting the first win there. And, just take it as it comes. John Joe, can I just ask you one? I mean, uh, you've been playing in a slightly different position. I mean, is it over forward? Is that the position you, you like? I know it's been a bit lean to most of the minute. Yeah, obviously, obviously Gap has put me in there to do a bit of a job in there. And, um, I do prefer it some games, but other games I think I don't feel I'm getting involved enough and stuff. So, just sort of depends really. You know, I'll do a stint there if I have to, but I think. I'm centre midfielder, really, you know. How is it different? I mean, is it, are you playing with your back to the goal more, or the game's behind you? Or? Well, I mean, if they're playing, it depends who we're playing and, you know, what they're playing in there. If they're playing a deeper, I'm normally sort of sitting on him and making sure he don't get on the ball and stuff like that. So, 
prefer to be sort of concentrating on us as opposed to sort of, you know, maybe dwelling on them or whatever and taking the game to them a bit more. But I can see why the gaffers put me in there and stuff, but I think when Brunty comes back and we get a few more back, I think, you know, I'll probably end up going back to, you know.